So SharePass collects every single transaction end-to-end, 24-7 in the production environments. So in principle, we maintain two types of the data. The first data is what we call the raw transaction path. This is the needle in the haystack. Every single transaction, all the way through all the different hops in the data center, is captured by SharePass and kept in the SharePass repository. What can you do with that? Let's say you have a specific user calling in complaining about a specific problem. Now you can go back in time and find that specific request and follow through exactly what it did throughout the different steps in your data center. This is used for many different aspects. Capacity planning, performance management, charge allocations, change management. This whole ecosystem of initiatives using our data is what we refer to as IT reliability. Making our IT more reliable is having the ability to predict capacity and plan ahead, to manage your performance problems the moment they happen, to maintain a constant view, an accurate view of your constantly changing data center in your CMPB and being able to get the money from the people who are actually consuming your resources, cost allocation or chargebacks. So the SharePress repository with its open API is open to any one of these initiatives throughout the IT organization. And we're also building an ecosystem of partners which are also using our data. So transactions are not just around SLA management and problem management the moment there is a problem in the production environment. Of course, it's a very important reason for buying SharePass and using SharePass. But on a day-to-day -day basis, you can get a lot of value just by using the repository for many of these different initiatives throughout your IT organization.